quite a slippy. Welcome back to the finale of Skating with the Stars. Next on the ice, the finalist who started out strong and never fell below second place on the judges' leaderboard. An amazing achievement. It's Salt Star Rebecca Buddick and her partner, Fred Palasak. So, Rebecca, for the final, we have to pick a song to reskate. Yeah. Um, first week, closer. I don't think we should do closer. I don't know. This is the first week. It was the first week. It's kind of slow. Yeah. I love the tango, but tango. I just don't see how we can make it better. Which one's the most uplifting one? Which one's got the most personality? I think Hot and Cold has a lot of energy. It definitely has the ability to be better. Agreed. Hot and Cold. It was the most exciting skate that we had. It was really, really fast. We have the best chance of winning with that one. Do you happen to remember yeah. the beginning of Hot and Cold? Yes. Good. Can you teach it to me? Because I don't remember. <laughs> We definitely don't want them to see the same routine. We've changed a little bit. We've changed some handholds. We got you skating on your own a little bit more. But one of the changes we're definitely not going to make is that last element. I injured my wrist doing the last element in our program of Hot and Cold. And ironically enough, it is that injury that's keeping me from practicing that lift. You know, ah! Really hurts, huh? Oh, really bad, yeah. I think if there's anything that'll get us to win, it could be this particular trick. One, two. I will sacrifice my wrist to get through this routine. Ready, and go. I can't. This has been my childhood dream. I so want to win this. Sorry, Bethany. This trophy's mine. It's OK, Bethany. You still have 12 jobs. Rebecca and Fred scored an impressive 50 points when they first skated this routine, and at the time, Johnny Weir said she was the most natural skater in the competition. Rebecca's wrist was causing her pain in dress rehearsal. Let's hope it doesn't affect this crucial performance. a great routine it just puts smiles on everyone's faces well done well done another standing ovation congratulations Fred congratulations Rebecca your fans are going crazy your family okay let's hear from the judges wanting to be a champion. Your lines have always been so balletic, so pure. Your center is so strong. Wonderful job. Congratulations. You are a world-class skater. Hey, Rebecca, I, I think Laurie a fan. <laughs> Johnny, 
Rebecca, you gave us so much soul tonight. You didn't rest on anything. You're in the final, all this pressure, you're number one coming in. You gave us the hardest jump combination we've <laughs> yeah. seen. Beautiful platter lift, the injured lift at the end. You were stunning. I take my hat off to you. You embraced this competition. You rocked it from beginning to end. I am so unbelievably proud of you. That was gorgeous. <laughs> okay, thank you. I'm quickly dick. Look, a true champion is somebody who will take full blast at it, even when they may not need it. That you did tonight, and that is the mark of a champion. When you first came into this competition, you looked like you were frightened to death. You have <laughs> never, was. never stepped back from that. The platter lift, the pencil lift, the double jump comp, it was all wonderful. And most of all, you made us feel comfortable, and you opened up and showed us what was inside you. Yeah. That was sensational. Excellent, thank you. Wonderful comments from the judges again. Well done. Go back to the kiss and cry. Congratulations on a stunning final performance. As you saw last night, your votes have the power to change everything. Are we in for another shock? Who knows? We'll find out very, very soon. Here's Tally. All right, well, Rebecca wasn't pulling any punches tonight, showing here a solid flip jump, checking her shoulders so she can plant her pick for yet another jump. So clean, so solid. Our first jump combination from Rebecca in this competition. And now moving on to this incredible crowd-pleasing lift, pushing through the pain that she was feeling in her wrist to give us a real showstopper to wrap up her final performance on our ice. Rebecca, how is that wrist feeling? That looked like it hurts. It hurts. It hurts, but I, now I can rest, so <laughs> there you go. <laughs> and you do need that rest. I mean, I, I understand that you've been pulling some insane schedules, 4 a.m. starts to shoot all my children, then going to train with Fred. How hard has it been competing in Skating with the Stars? It's been hard. It's been challenging, but it was so worth it, and the show was great, and working it out with my schedule, so... We had a lot of fun, didn't we, Fred? We did. We had a little, we, we had a little fun along the way, I yeah, think. We did. And Fred, how badly do you want to lift that trophy tonight? You know, for Rebecca, of course I want to. She's worked so hard. Um, yeah, I couldn't have asked for a better partner. Well, let's see if that's reflected now in your technical scores. Will the judges please reveal their scores for technical merit? Laurie Ann Gibson. Ten. Johnny Weir. Ten. Dick Button. Ten. You have the first perfect score in the competition. How does that feel? It feels great. I know it's only a TV show, but it feels great. <laughs> All right, well, let's see your artistic impression scores. And now the scores for artistic impression. Laurie-Ann Gibson. 10. Johnny Weir. 10. Nick Button. 10. Impression. That brings her total to a 60. It doesn't get any better than that, does it? No, no. That's, I'm, I'm amazed. I'm shocked. I'm flattered. <laughs> Thank you. Well, congratulations to you both. But that was incredible. The judges' scores for both pairs are in, but we still have to factor in your votes to make up the other half of their final totals. There can only be one champion. Vernon?